Greetings everyone. This is Rajesh Kumar from Aditya School of Business Management, first year MBA. Here I want to share about the latest excellent documentary of Mr. Infosys Narayana Murthy. Before I begin, I want to thank my management and my professor Dr. N. Sundara Pandian to giving this opportunity to uh, develop my latest excellence. Here we go. Nagwara Ramarao Narayana Muthi, most popularly known as Narayana Muthi, is a co-founder of Infosys, a multinational corporation that provides service pertaining to technology, engineering, consulting and outsourcing. Narayana Muthi was not born with a silver phone in his mouth. In fact, he had to work extremely hard to reach the top. He was born on August 20, 1946 in Mysore, Karnataka. He came from a poor but an educated family. From his childhood days, Narayana Muthi was academically brilliant. He was passionate about mathematics and physics and always had the thirst and desire to gain more knowledge in this field. NC passed as a bachelor degree in electrical engineering from the University of Mysore and later received his master degree from the Indian Institute of Technology, Kanpur. Although Narayana Murthy was born into a poor family, his dreams were huge from a young age. He dreamed of starting his own business venture. Narayana Murthy begins his career as a chief system programmer at IAM Agamadabad, he then started a company called Softronic which failed after 1.5 years of his inception. Despite the failure he encountered at the early age, he did not give up on his dream of being an entrepreneur. He learned from his previous mistake and decided to start a fresh in 1981. That year he together with six software professionals put together 10,000 to create a company called Infosys. From the beginning, the team kept the interest of the company ahead of their own interest and each of the team members brought complementary strength to the company. Infosys is today a highly innovative software service global company listed in NYSC in US and Bombay Stock Exchange in Mumbai. Mr. Muthi conceptualized, articulated and implemented the global delivery model GDM which has become the backbone of the Indian software industry. GDM is based on the collaborative distributor software development principles as resulted in the delivery of superior quality software to the global customer delivery on time within budget. Mr. Muthi also introduced the concept of 24 hours workday to the world. Under Mr. Muthi leadership, Infosys became the leader in innovation in technical, managerial and leadership training, software technology, quality productivity, Customer focus, employee satisfaction, and physical and technological infrastructure. In 2014, Mr. Muthi was ranked 13th among CNBC's 25 global business leaders and listed among the 12 greatest entrepreneurs of our times. By fortune in 2012, he has received the Legion of the Honor from France, CB from Britain. The economics ranked him among the 10 most admired global business leaders in 2005. Mr. Muthi is uh, ranked among the top 10 financial time list of business pioneer in technology published in March 2015. He is the first Indian winner of Ernest and Young World Entrepreneur of the Year Award. Mr. Muthi was elected as a member of the prestigious Academy of American of Arts and Science. In 2019, he is a foreign member of the US National Academy of Engineering and a fellow of the Indian National Academy of Engineering. He received the Founder Medal in 2018, Hoover Medal in 2012, and the Ernest Weber Medal in 2007. All these three from IAAA. He, re he has received the Thompson Jeffrey Medal and James C. Morgan Global Humanitarian Award. He is a member of the Advisory Board of the University of Tokyo, Japan, ESSEC Business School, France, ICSE Business School in Spain and Fiontango do Cobral FDC Brazil. He is also a member of a board of government and trustee of the Asian Institute of Management Manila. He has served as a member of the board of various well-known university in US, Cornell University, Wanda School of Business, Graduate School of Business at Stanford University and the Rhodes Trust at Oxford he was the chairman of the Indian Institute of Management, Ahmedabad, number one business school in India and the Public Health Foundation, PHFI. He is also on the International Advisory Board of the LA University of Illinois at Urban Campaign, William F. H. Meyer, Center for the Global Leadership of Tep School of Business, Singapore Management University and SEAD, Asian Institute of Technology, Bangkok, 
द इंडियन स्कूल ऑफ बिजनेस हैदराबाद एंड द इंटरनेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ इंफॉर्मेशन टेक्नोलॉजी बैंगलोर ही इज आल्सो अ ट्रस्टी ऑफ द इंफोसिस साइंस फाउंडेशन व्हिच गवर्न्स द इंफोसिस प्राइज एंड एनुअल अवार्ड टू ऑनर आउटस्टैंडिंग अचीवमेंट ऑफ रिसर्चर्स एंड साइंटिस्ट अक्रॉस सिक्स कैटेगरी today narayan muthi is listed as the one of the greatest entrepreneurs of all time alongside steve jobs and bill gates in 2000 he was awarded padma shri by the government of india for a significant contribution to the company side the sector and economy in 2008 he was awarded padma vibhushan india's second is civil again award on june 1 2013 narayan muthi was called out of his retirement to lead the company once again narayan muthi who will turn 67 this year has taken up the challenge to bring the company back on its feet he has taken up the position of additional director and the executive chairman of the board with the company and he is working closely with the top management to come up with incentives such as giving higher salary to the top performer to improve the performance of the company This is a true example of commitment and dedication even after his retirement Narayan Muthi is willing to sacrifice his luxury to revive the company Currently Mr Muthi serves on the board of the Institute for the Advanced Study at Princeton New Jersey and the United Nations Foundation he has served as a uh, board of Ford Foundation in New York HSBC and Union Level in London he was the chairman of the Indian Institute of Management Ahmedabad Being born into a poor family did not deter Narayan Muthi from pursuing his dream. This is what we can learn from Narayan Muthi determination in success. Anyone can in education and career if and she put his mind and heart to it. Lack of financial resources is not a excuse for a dull career, William Shakespeare once said. It is not in the start to hold our destiny but in us. Similarly just become one is born to a poor family does not mean that he and she will remain poor and unsuccessful for the rest of the life if we are passionate about changing our future our dream will definitely come true life is full of challenges we also make mistakes it is important to learn from them and rise in our academics and professional life too yeah thank you for the giving opportunity to sharing about the corporate monster mr infosys narayana murthy thank you